Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. Today in this short video, I'm going to show you how to translate your WordPress website both with auto translation and manual translation. And we will be translating this website. This is basically a marketplace website that we created in our last video. So if you need a marketplace website, you can follow my previous video. And uh, I also have a video about translation in which I have covered the three methods. But in this video, I'm going to show you a free method and uh, we'll show you how you can auto translate your website and then how you can do manual fixes so the first thing is you can just go to wordpress dashboard and then go to plugins add new and here search for wiglot and you will see this plugin wiglot translate just install and activate this and after activating the plugin you will get this message so click on wiglot configuration and this will need an API key to work properly so for that you can create an Wiglot account and you can get your API key so to get your API key just click on this Wiglot and this will take you to Wiglot where you can learn more about Wiglot and as you can see a fully translated website the simple way and here you can create an account by your email and password and if you already have an account you can click on login so let me log into my account and this is the dashboard of Wiglot where you can see your previous websites if you have and you can add a new website and to add a new project you can click on this plus then you can write your project name and the website technology so I'll write this for example and under website technology you can select Warface so as you can see this is compatible with all these platforms I'll choose Wordpress and I'll click next and now this will generate an API key for us and this is our API key so we can just copy this and then we will paste that in the Wiglot plugin so let's go back to our dashboard we will paste the key here and here you can choose your original language so in this case it's English and then we can choose a destination language to which we want to translate the website so I'll choose German you can add multiple languages if you want then click on save changes and that's it well done your website is now multilingual and you can close this or you can go to your front page to see it now this is the original website by the way this is a static text that i put in the elementor but if you visit a normal page like uh, let's see if i visit blog page for example you can see this text this and these are not translated because these are dynamic and are not from Elementor. Now let's check this. So with regular plugin you will get this pop-up. So you can click on this. You can choose a secondary language. So let's choose this. This will reload the website. And now you can see this is translated to German language. Also this one, this and this. And now if you want to make some fixes to the walls, you can do it easily by going to Wiglot and click on edit with visual editor and this will open up visual editor for you where you can translate specific text like if i hover mouse over here i can see this edit icon and now i can change only this text so let's say this is not right i can translate this and then we'll click ok let's close this i can also make changes to these if i click this now this is in English as you can see and this is its translation and if there is any problem with this I can change a specific word or I can change this complete sentence and this is how this plugin works. So this was how you can translate your WordPress website using the Glot plugin for free and you can do both manual and auto translations and if you want to learn more about WordPress and Inventor and WooCommerce you can follow my channel I have lots of videos about WordPress. Still, if you have any questions, you can ask in the comment section. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next.